Hello coin collectors out there, fans of the international coins. Welcome back to the DC Coin World channel. Hopefully you're having a great day. In this video, we're gonna share with you coins from India. In particular, these two, two rupee coins. And if time allows, we'll sneak in this one right here too at the end of the video to give you kind of a teaser on what other videos I'm going to be making. So we've got two of the two rupee coins right here. As you can see, there are some differences. The main differences are right down here at the bottom of the coin. This one is dated 2016 and it has a star at the bottom. This one is dated 2015 and has a dot at the bottom. So we'll explain what those, what that means, as well as some other details such as the value, the metal content, and the different designs that you'll see here on the coin in this video. Let's move this one aside so we can just focus in on one. Get some good lighting for it. So here we go. Uh, this coin was made from 2011 until 2018. Its value is two rupees which is abbreviated to INR. It has a United States value, a translated value of about three cents United States dollars. Its metal content is stainless steel, so that's kind of why it's hard to get the lighting right on the coin. Uh, some of the copper coins are easier to get a good uh, lighting on. The stainless steel reflects the light and makes it shine and hard for, hard for the lighting to work, but we're doing the best we can. So this coin has a weight of 4.9 grams, diameter of 25 millimeters, and a thickness of 1.54. Now the different mint marks down here at the bottom, let me explain what those mean. So the uh, small dot slash diamond indicates Mumbai. The five-pointed star indicated Hyperbad. The um, small or large dot indicates Noida. And the no mint mark indicates Calcutta. So I've got a dot right here. So that indicates that it is from the Nuida Mint. Now this one right here has a star on the bottom. So that indicates that it is from the Hyperbad Mint. So those are different mint marks right there. I'll just run them down one more time in case that is particularly interesting to you. Uh, small dot slash diamond indicates Mumbai. Uh, five pointed star Hyperbad. Small or large dot indicates Nuida and then uh, no mint mark indicates Calcutta. Now, as far as the mintages, unfortunately, I don't have them for the two rupee coin. I'm not sure if they were never released or the source that I'm having just wasn't able to get them yet. But we're looking at the reverse side of the coin, so let's talk about the design that we see right here. So we see the denomination. We also see the date below the rupee symbol flanked by the lotus flower. So we see the rupee symbol down here. We see the denomination and then we've got the lotus flowers going around the outside right here. So rupee, denomination, lotus flower, lotus flower. When we flip it over, we've got another cool design right here. Again, I'll adjust the lighting for you. Might have to hold it up a little. So this right here is the Ioska Pillar Lion Capital. So this is a symbol that I see a lot on the uh, Indian coins. We also see some lettering down at the bottom, which translates to India. Then we've got it on India right here and then India right here. Sorry, my apologies about the, uh, the shininess of this coin. It's just hard to get the lighting just right. So let's try with this coin. So this coin right here is a similar one. Uh, the same kind of series, except it just comes from a different mint. Now, I would imagine that the mintages on these are actually quite high, just given the fact that there are different mint marks, so that indicates, you know, there are not enough production abilities at one mint alone. Now, we talked about the two rupee. Let's bring in this coin right here very quickly. Uh, it's got a rhino on it. This is the 25 pesa coin. It was made from 1988 up until today. So what you see on the reverse is a, um, it's a in Indian rhinoceros facing the left. And then on the other side, we see a very similar uh, style with that Ioska line capital at the top. And then the 25 paces down here, 25 pesa down here. All right, everyone, that's all I've got for this cool video about Indian coins. Hopefully you enjoyed it. If you're into coin collecting, please do check out the other videos on this channel. Thank you very much, everyone, and best of luck coin collecting out there. Take care.